So here is the only reason why we do network marketing. It's to create leverage because leverage is the only way to create wealth. Okay. And again, like I said in the beginning, anybody who wants to debate me on that, more than welcome to put the comments in the section below. So my acronym for leverage is L is levels. Just keep in mind for leverage, you have to have levels. Can't be just one. It has to, ha it has to be a group, a network, a number of units, etc. And maybe in another video, we'll, I'll, I'll show you where the leverage is in other businesses. So the next two words are engage. And keep in mind, this mostly is written for uh, network marketing, but I would imagine it could be applied to other businesses with leverage. Okay, so these go together in network marketing, engage vibration. So what, what that means is it means your vibration is who you are. However you vibrate, some people vibrate um, in a very negative level and some people very vibrate in a very positive level. So you can imagine what I mean. And down the video, I'll, I'll, I'll show you why egos are good or what I believe ego means and the different egos in, in a business structure. Okay. But just keep in mind, there's a certain vibration on somebody who would do network marketing. So if you're at that vibration, great. You're going to attract people that are that vibration and you have to put it out in the world. So you have to engage your vibration. You actually have to be who you are in the world. Otherwise, possibly things aren't going to come to you. So it's, it's about being who you are or raising your vibration. So if you're a little bit negative, maybe a little, making yourself a little more positive or whatever it is. Or, or change your vibration. If you have a vibration of an employee, for example, or a self practitioner, if you want to do network marketing, you're going to have to change that vibration. You're going to have to change your ego. You're going to have to be something different and then bring that to the world because then you'll attract people like that. Like baseball. If you like baseball, you're going to go out in the street. And you're going to play baseball and people who want to play with you are going to be baseball players. You're not going to find soccer players are going to come and play with you or football. Football is my favorite sport. One of my favorite sports. So, I mean, if you want to, you want people to go out and play football, don't hang out with the soccer players because you're not going to be able to play football. You're going to be playing soccer. Uh, and you know, so keep that in mind when it comes to this, you, you have to really take a look at what type of people do network marketing. If you want to do it and try to start to become like them, not necessarily exactly how they do things, but their vibration, the, you know, who they are as people, what they believe, what their concepts and spirituality, you know, are in life. Okay, the next word is evolve. E-V-O-L-V-E. E e okay, and this is like I think a very important word in this because when you go out and you get a job and you're an employee and you're getting a hundred thousand dollars a year job or the two hundred thousand dollar a year job or the fifty thousand dollar a year job, as soon as you start working, as soon as you walk through the door, you start getting paid and you can start kept get getting paid that rate regardless of whether it's your first week or your fifty second week. Is it 52nd week? Yeah, 52nd week of the year. You're, you're going to get that rate. In network marketing, it's an evolution. Uh, when you step in, you're probably not going to be making any money. Not until you start building the network. Not until your network starts to evolve. When your network starts to evolve, which could take, you know, depending on how you are, three months, six months, one year, two years, five years, ten years, it could take to, to actually evolve that network that I showed you. But is it worth it for the $21,000 a month? It's, that's totally up to you and that's totally up to your, your vibration, who you are. But just keep in mind, you're not going to become wealthy overnight. This is not a get rich quick scheme. I used to have one mentor in network marketing and he used to say, it's a get rich quicker scheme. So you're not going to get rich quick, but you'll get rich quicker than if you're just an employee making the $50,000 a year. Okay. And then we have repeat. So R E P E A T. And that means just, Keep repeating your story and we'll talk later on what are the steps to network marketing, but basically you have a story. So you come in, you know, a lot of times I tell people, oh, just tell me this crazy girl came up to you and said all these things about network marketing. So you're going to try it out. But whatever your story is on how you got involved or why you got involved in network marketing, just repeat it to somebody. And it's like lifting weights. I love to work out. If you lift a weight once or work out one day, you're going to get X results. You lift a weight or work out for two weeks, you're going to get another set of results. If you do it for six months, you'll get another set of results. You do it for a year and then two years and five years and then 10 years and 20 and 30 years, you know, you'll be, you'll, you know, you'll be in great shape. Um, so keep that in mind. This is not, you know, you just go out and talk to one person and therefore all of a sudden or three people and all of a sudden you've evolved your, your, your plan. It's not like that. You have to repeat it just like anything in life. Anything in life is repeating it. 
And if you do all that, you will attain growth exponentially. I hope I'm spelling this right. If I'm not, just let it be. But the idea, and this is a key word exponentially, is if you go out and you grow yourself as an employee or self-practitioner, you may start making more money throughout the years, but you're still just doing it based on one person's efforts. When you start to do all of this and create leverage, all of a sudden you have exponential growth. So all of a sudden those three people become, you know, 9, 27, whatever down the line. And all of a sudden, boom, you have a lot of people on the bottom. So it's like, there's a great example and I won't, bother you right here with the actual answer, but maybe I'll do it in another video. If you take one penny that duplicates itself for 31 days, how much is that penny at the end of the 31 days? So that's one penny is now two pennies. No, one penny is one is two pennies. Two pennies become four pennies. Four pennies become eight pennies and so on and so on. When you do that, you have what we call exponential growth. And if nothing else, just look at that comp plan. Do you want to be paid on one person or do you want to be paid on like 3,000 people? Um, so this is the only, again, this is the only reason why we do network marketing. We do it to create leverage. And there's so many examples in the physical world that will show you how leverage really helps you do something and helps make an effort so much easier. Like I remember when I was a little kid, we used to go to the park down the block and we used to get on the seesaw. My mother and I would get on the seesaw and obviously even though she was a petite woman, I was much smaller than her then, and I used to be able to lift her on the seesaw. And the only reason why I was able to do that is because of leverage. You get on a seesaw, you put the people in the right spots on the seesaw, the lighter person can lift the heavier person because of the leverage in the seesaw. So that's one simple example, but there's many, many examples. Um, I, I like to work out a lot. They talk about train your leverages if you want to lift heavier. So sometimes you want to train your muscles, sometimes you want to train your leverages. While I'm saying that, I want to thank Benny, BigBenches.com, for making me buy this video equipment. This is just another example of life and how it works. I wanted him to make a video or a DVD of his stretching technique so that I can go down in my basement and just follow him. He refused to do it for whatever reason. I started to get really mad at him, so I went out and I bought the video set up so that I would go into the gym and I would videotape him. And for whatever reason, he still wouldn't do it. But the funny thing is, is I realized at the end that I wasn't pushing him to do these DVDs or video for his sake. I was doing it for mine because it was about time that I started doing these videos for my channel, which is Channel Peace With Me, which really stems from not network marketing, but stem from a book I'm writing ooh, called Peace With Me, where knowledge is power and understanding is peace. But anyway, I wanted to thank Benny. BigBenches.com. Go to his website, check him out. He's a great guy, first of all. Second of all, he has this great stretching stuff that he does on me at the gym every half, for a half an hour every week. And the gym is Gaglione Strength in Farmingdale, New York. If you're interested in powerlifting, which, you know, I did more bodybuilding style workouts for most of my life or all of my life. And then I started powerlifting recently, which I'll tell you another cute story. It all happened because I sent the link to the Groupon for Gaglione Strength to a friend of mine, which I had found out about Gaglione from Vitamin World. And the guy said, if you want to do powerlifting, Gaglione is the greatest guy to do it and so on and so forth. So anyway, somehow I found the Groupon. I go online, I send it to my friend. She buys it. I don't buy it yet. So I said, oh my God, I better buy it. So I go online, I buy the Groupon. We go to the gym together. She stays for one time. Does it go back? I end up joining the gym. So again, it's another way that somebody pushes you somehow to your track in life, even though it's not their track in life. So it's very possible that you'll get into network marketing or somebody will show this to you and it's not your track in life. And that's okay. That's okay. And the person showing the video to you, remember, not everybody's going to do network marketing. This is not for everybody, but that's okay. Because there are billions, literally billions of people in the world. You need to have three strong people who want to do this to really make a lot of money. If you have six people, that's great. If you have more than six people, that's even better. But it's you and your three friends and so on down the line. If you could just keep that in mind that this is all about you and where you want to go in life. It's all about you and your path in life. And whoever wants to join you, join you, that's fine. I know a lot of people talk about where is everybody going and what is everybody wearing. Not that that was ever my thing, but it's not. But it's always the way I see life is this is where I'm going. You want to come with me, you're more than welcome. And on that point, I want to make 
The other beautiful thing about network marketing and this leverage versus any other business there is, the reason why it's such a beautiful spiritual business, one of the reasons is, is because you could take that comp plan and you could take this opportunity and you can literally share it with somebody and they get the same exact opportunity that you have without taking anything away from you. That does not happen in any other business. If I'm a broker, real estate broker, for example, and I teach a great sales rep how to do well and become a great sales rep, they can eventually go out and they could open up their own brokerage. And now all of a sudden, this guy that I trained is my competition. If you're a star, there's no way, or a football player, because I like football players better. But if you're, if you're a football player and you are a great football player, you can't give that to your kids. Maybe they will genetically be good, or maybe your family, your mother, whatever. You can all give them money that you've made, but you can't put them in the NFL with you because they just can't do what you do. Anybody can do network marketing. And it's, again, I don't want to get this video to be too long because I want it to be short, sweet, and simple, but this is the only business. And this is why it is my opinion, the new capitalism, I noticed this when I was writing this acronym, that if you cut this off over here and you look at this word, it's rage. So it just made me think that there's a lot of people in the world, especially now, that are very angry, you know, for a lot of different reasons. But one of the big chants in the world is, you know, it's always the rich people are in control of everything, the rich people, you know, are getting richer and the poor are getting poorer, poorer. Well, if you don't learn as a quote unquote poor person or a middle class person or somebody doesn't is not leveraged, is not part of the wealthy, if you don't learn this concept and apply this concept, you will never be wealthy. And again, I'll challenge anybody on that. Write in the comments, you know, yell at me all you want, do whatever you want to say. But you, anybody, I could be wrong, but show me a place where you can become wealthy without using leverage. I will research it and I will do it, you know, if, if that's true. But there is no, there is no other way to become wealthy. You must leverage yourself. And in network marketing, everybody, for basically $150 a month, if you can't do that, if you tell, somebody tells you, I don't have $150 a month, first of all, let me tell you something first. This is not a commitment for $150 a month. You can always cancel your order. You can always lower your order. Say for one month, you're not going to earn a commission or whatever. Just make like a $10 order of toothpaste. You know, like doTERRA's toothpaste is excellent. I love their toothpaste and everybody needs toothpaste, I hope. So, you know, just lower your order for that month. It's not like a traditional business where you have your rent payment, your electric bill, your, your whatever bills, your employee bills and all kinds of things that you must pay every month. You must. Whether you do business in that place or not, the electric is going to go on and the rent is going to be due. And, you know, the network marketing, that doesn't happen. There's so many beautiful reasons. But let me go back to the rage. Um, anybody who is, is angry or outraged about wealth in this world, you want to talk about redistribution of wealth? Network marketing is the fair, capitalistic way to redistribute wealth. Well, whatever the word is, redistribu redistribution of wealth, okay? Without taking from the wealthy who have worked hard for it and just giving it to the poor for doing absolutely nothing, which creates, everybody's got to read Atlas Shrugged, which creates a society that's just based on need, which doesn't work. Capitalism works. In a big society like in America, capitalism works. In a smaller society where there's less people, maybe socialism works. I'll give you an example of this, which I'll give you an example of that. If I have a family of three kids and I make enough money to support the three kids and these three kids grow up and they're adults and they don't want to work, I still make enough money. I could support the three kids. Maybe even if they have a kid of their own. Now I got six people I can, uh, uh, to six people I have to support. Maybe I could do it. But now let's just say I got a hundred kids. Most probably I don't have enough money to support a hundred kids. And if they all start having kids, I don't have enough money to support them. So one person can't do it. So in a small society, a socialistic society, a socialism may work. In a huge society like America, it doesn't work. Number one. And number two, it's not our culture. It's not our spirituality. I'm sorry. It's not mine. So um, anybody who wants a socialist country, well, we could talk about that later, but... Again, this is a no hype zone. So I'm going to tell you what I think and it's not going to be politically correct. Okay. So just keep that in mind. If you don't, if you, if you're enraged about the way the world is today, you know, stop crying, stop complaining and do something that leverages yourself and network marketing. Again, you may not be able to do real estate, real estate, very, very, very difficult. You have to have a good amount of money, a lot of capital, especially in New York. You have to know what you're doing or you're going to get tanked. If you don't have good instincts and you're not extremely intelligent, 
you're going to lose a lot of money in real estate. Um, because quite frankly, so many, every one of those things I went to, many, many seminars, they all tell you, take money out of your 401k, do a 1031 exchange, and this is how you're going to become rich in the real estate business. And, you know, that's true for a certain group of people who actually have good instincts for real estate. Not many people do. You don't need to have good instincts necessarily for network marketing. You like the product or you don't like the product. It's as simple as that. When you understand the comp plan, which is, again, I said it's very easy. You either do it or you don't. Uh, again, I will give anybody the Excel spreadsheet or somehow email me or talk to me in the comments below. Um, and that's it. I'm trying to think if there's anything else I wanted to say in this video. Probably not. The next videos or the next few videos will be again about the egos and the different energies uh, for network marketing.